Psalm number 103. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget none of his benefits. Who pardons all your iniquities, who heals all your diseases, who redeems your life from the pit, who crowns you with a loving kindness and compassion, who satisfies your ears with good things, so that your youth is renewed like an eagle. The Lord performs righteous deeds and judgments for all who are oppressed. And he made known his ways to Moses, his acts to the sons of Israel. The Lord is compassionate and gracious, slow to anger, and abounding in loving kindness. He will not always tie with us, nor will keep his anger forever. He has not dealt with us according to our sins, nor rewarded us according to our iniquities. For as high as the heavens are above the earth, so great is his loving kindness toward those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, as far as so removed are transgressions from us, just as a father has compassion on his children, so the Lord has compassion on those who fear him. For he himself knows our frame. He is mindful that we are but dressed. As for me, man, his days are like grass, as a flower of the field, so he flourishes. When the wind has passed over it, it is no more, and its place acknowledges it no longer. But the loving kindness of the Lord is from everlasting to everlasting on those who fear him, and his righteousness to children's righteousness, the children. To those who keep his covenant and remember his precepts to do them, the Lord has established his throne in heavens, and his sovereignty rules over all. Bless the Lord, you his angels, mighty in strength, who perform his word, obeying the voice of his word. Bless the Lord, all of his hosts, you, are, you who serve him doing his will. Bless the Lord, all your works of his, in all places of his dominion. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Let's all read together verses 21 and 22. 21 and 22. Bless the Lord, all of his hosts, you who serve him doing his will. Bless the Lord, all your works of his. In all places of his dominion, bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Please be seated. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You know, uh, when we uh, read this psalm, psalm number 103, uh, specifically, you know, Sam is this writing something there to just remember the things that, that uh, the Lord has done for us. Amen. So, as we are just, I mean, uh, completing 2022 and uh, uh, having our 20, 2023 ahead, you know, we just do one thing that we have no time to give all the testimonies, I mean, uh, what we had in, uh, in the year of 2022. But at the same time, we can give few minutes for the people, those who are not able to uh, come for next Sunday. Okay, so there are some people traveling, so we need to pray for them especially. So they will be sharing their testimonies and they will not get time uh, for sharing their testimony on next Sunday. So they can share their testimony and their prayer request also. And in the next Sunday, you will be getting time to uh, share all the testimonies and maybe yearly testimony. You know, one year full, you may be having many things to share. And you can share that and you can increase the people. And uh, so, uh, this time, you know, as uh, the psalmist is saying in uh, 103, uh, Psalm number 103, verse, uh, uh, verse 5, it says that who satisfies, that means God satisfies your ears with good things so that your youth is renewed like the eagle. I mean, so what God does for, for the people of God, he satisfies your ears. I mean, so when we are entering into a new year, let us believe that our God is able to, able to satisfy us. I mean, what is that verse in Malayalam? That means, you know, God is filling your mouth with the goodness of God. 
that means you have many things to share about god with your mouth right you know why we are keeping testimonies and why we are keeping the prayer request and praise report in our worship services because god is always filling us men so god is satisfying us and we are proclaiming the work of god with our mouth okay because god is filling us filling us filling us you know in in psalm number 23 also we have been i mean reading that and discussing about uh, uh, psalm number 23 many times that we read that the psalmist is saying that okay, i am a just a sheep but there is a shepherd hallelujah or idayan unde aa idayan aan endi ennade enne oro dosu narachu kondirikkunnade hallelujah so when the shepherd is i mean filling me and satisfy me and that is more than enough in my spiritual and material life hallelujah so let us thank god for everything and also that um, uh, verse um, verse verse 19 it says that the lord has established his throne in the heavens and his sovereignty rules over all i mean if you believe that then god's sovereignty rules over all that means ee devathinte paramaadhikaram endiyunu എല്ലാത്തിനെയും ഭരിക്കുന്നു ഓക്കെ ദ സോവറിനിറ്റി ഓഫ് ഗോഡ് യു നോ മെനി ടൈംസ് ദ ദ പീപ്പിൾ ആർ തിങ്കിങ് ആൻഡ് സം ഓഫ് ദ പീപ്പിൾ ആർ ആസ്കിങ് എ ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻ ഇഫ് ഗോഡ് ഈസ് ദേർ ഇഫ് ഗോഡ് ഈസ് ദേർ ഓക്കെ ആൻഡ് ഇഫ് ഗോഡ് ഈസ് എക്സിസ്റ്റിംഗ് ഓർ ഇഫ് ഗോഡ് ഈസ് ലിവിങ് വൈ ദീസ് തിങ്സ് ആർ ഹാപ്പനിങ് ദർ ആർ പീപ്പിൾ ആസ്കിങ് ദാറ്റ് ഇഫ് ഗോഡ് ഈസ് ദേർ ആൻഡ് ഇഫ് ഗോഡ് ഈസ് ലിവിങ് ദൻ വൈ ദീസ് ഓൾ കൈൻഡ്സ് ഓഫ് tragedies are happening or the universal calamities are happening you know nowadays in in new york and james is said okay i'll i'll tell about you you know uh, in new york and that that area the people are struggling the people are struggling because of the snow and uh, what is that cyclone uh, bomb or something you know uh, the the issues are i mean like the many things are happening there at the same time the people are asking if there is a god then why all these things are happening the answer is the answer is there is a god and his sovereignty is ruling over all the earth he knows everything but there are something that god is permitting god is allowing to happen in this world amen because the bible very clearly says that there are many things going to happen this is nothing this is nothing there are many things going to happen there are many things going to happen in this world therefore in this all the nadavil എന്താണ് സംഭവിക്കുന്നത് ദൈവത്തിന് മക്കളെ കർത്താവ് എന്ത് ചെയ്യുന്നു സുരക്ഷിതരായി സൂക്ഷിച്ചു കൊണ്ടിരിക്കുന്നു വി ഹാവ് പീപ്പിൾ ടു ഷെയർ മെനി ടെസ്റ്റമണീസ് ദാറ്റ് ദ പീപ്പിൾ ഓഫ് ഗോഡ് ആർ സേഫ് ഇൻ ദ ഓൾ മൈ ടി ഹാൻഡ്സ് ഹലോ ലൂയ ആൻഡ് ദസ് റീസൺ ഇസ് സേസ് ദാറ്റ് ദ സോവറൈൻ ഗാഡ് ഈസ് ദേർ ആൻഡ് ദ സോവറൈൻറ്റി ഓഫ് ഗാഡ് ഈസ് ഓൾവേസ് കൺട്രോളിംഗ് ഓൾ ദ പീപ്പിൾ ആൻഡ് ഹാവിങ് ദി അതോറിറ്റി ആൻഡ് റൂളിംഗ് ഓവർ എവറിങ് ആൻഡ് ഹീ ഡസ് എവറിങ് വാട്ട് ഹി ലൈക്ക് men we cannot question god and god is doing everything according to hell his will and according to his purpose amen so let us all enjoy the presence of god